So I think we have, uh, the only other two options we have is uh, a crowbar, some buff out, <laughs> C4, and after that, uh, I don't think we have any other ideas. What was that? You set off a gas trap and take a point of damage. It's a little concerning because, uh, where do you go? That's what we saw in that account from the Ancient Brotherhood. Our right, Ian's unhurt. Just in case something uh, really nasty comes along. Okay. Hopefully we won't get cut to ribbons by some laser trap. Uh, trip the laser wire. Taking three points of damage. Man. Why wasn't there an option to... Alright, let's look at this door. Door is welded too tight for you to open it. See if we have that crowbar. <laughs> I don't like Lily's gonna be able to do this. <laughs> it's worth it. She has to try though, I guess. The door is welded too tight for you to open it. I think she'll try the C4 before uh, taking the buff out. I have a feeling this isn't going to work either. He's in the way. Okay. Thirty seconds. Drop in the C4. Maybe we should have planted it on the door. I think she's going to. See if they turn off these traps. No, it's just power. We didn't see that option on the mainframe either. Due to your inept handling, the explosive death detonates prematurely. I don't think it did anything. Did we try it this way? Crowbar? That does nothing. I think she's gonna try it with the buff out. Man. Nope. Alright, I think we're just gonna have to leave it. Nope. Okay. <laughs> so now she's uh, all pumped up. Buff out. Trying to retrace uh, her steps, avoid whatever these traps were. All right. And I don't think we're gonna get a rope back, but uh, I think that's fair for even just this combat armor. I think has made uh, this trip worth it. I guess that's on the list to pick up a uh, rope. Actually, I think we want to go back to the hub and uh, sell some of these things, maybe with Beth. Be awfully surprised if we make it without uh, an encounter. Alright, looks like uh, two thugs. One's with a knife. I think we're too worried about this. 
Hopefully, Ian will not. Well, might take a shot at this raider, so I think she's got to get out of the way first. Okay. I don't know what Ian's shooting, but uh, <laughs> it's effective. Okay. What was he firing? I don't think we know. Okay. Look at all that. Small energy cells, 44. Okay. I guess we can use this right now. More 10 millimeter firearms. Oh no. I think Ian's uh, uninjured. Yeah, he's unhurt. As are we. Okay. Fifty-two, so I think uh, we're still okay with the radiation. Gonna get that crowbar back to Ian. Okay. Yeah, so on to the hub to, uh, hawk these, uh, mostly firearms, I think. A few energy weapons. Hopefully they're, uh, worth a good price. Yeah, now Lily has, uh, armor comparable with the police. <laughs> Look at that. Didn't realize that that's what they were wearing. So it must be good stuff. Yeah, I think we're gonna save all that. Oh, let's see what this is worth. Look at that, fourth over 4,000 caps. I don't even think uh, Beth has that many caps. I think we're gonna have to take a loss. Well. That or we can throw some things in here and sell them back. I don't want to spend too long on this though. I'm trying to get every cap. Mauser and SMG and then uh, take a loss. That's a lot of caps though. So I think Ian has uh, some things. Yeah, I think we're going to sell all these 10 millimeter firearms. Ian's got enough backup deagles <laughs> that even if she destroys her uh, shotgun. You know what? I think actually she's going to drop stuff temporarily. So she can pick up as much as she can for me and just holding on to these two rifles, SMG. I don't know how much these weigh, but I guess we'll drop them. It's probably good. Okay. 